Installation of eHealth Alarm Forwarder Live Exceptions Alarms to Spectrum Event Restful Service The Alarm Forwarder for Alarm Integration from CAE Health to CA Spectrum uses RESTful web services. It reads the eHealth database tables to find live exception rays or clear events and forward any new or updated alarms to Spectrum. This video outlines how to install and configure the components required for this integration. The Alarm Forwarder package is now part of the eHealth installation and resides in the following location. To install Alarm Forwarder, copy the file Alarm Forwarder tar gz to the $nh underscore home slash custom directory and then expand it. Once the files are extracted, update the alarm forwarder ini.pm file. For Windows systems, specify the variable tz in the file alarm forwarder. Dot. Example, set tz equal to est5 edt. Copy the batch file alarm forwarder. Dot bat to $nh underscore home slash bin slash sys. Add alarm forwarder bat to the eel startup cfg. Edit the startup.cfg file and add the following. Restart eHealth server. Please note that this solution uses the environment variable percent nh underscore user percent to determine the Oracle TNS connection string. It has been observed that this does not work on some Windows servers. To test, try connecting to the local eHealth database instance using the command line. If you receive the error, then a new variable must be configured. The percent nh underscore user percent will be nh underscore user, server name and oracle SID. For Linux systems, copy the shell script file alarm forwarder dot sh to dollar nh underscore home slash bin slash sys. Add alarm forwarder dot sh for Linux, or alarm forwarder dot bat for Windows to the eel startup dot cfg. Edit the startup dot cfg and add the following. Restart eHealth server. Now, let us look at the installation of the required Spectrum files. Download restevent.tar.gz to the $spcroot directory and expand the file. Once we extract restevent.tar.gz file into Spectrum installation folder, Tomcat subfolders lib and webops are modified. The next step is to take a backup of the XML file and edit it. Edit the XML file to input the code as shown here. After the line with event servlet and com.co.spectrum.restful.servlet.gd event servlet. The lines should then be as shown here. Restart. One click. Edit, event disp, and add the following lines. Reload the event configuration files. To update the overall alert and event system more broadly, for a given landscape, in one click, click the update event configuration button that is available on the Spectra server control subview of the information tab on the VNA model. Or, update action to the VNA model handle. Please note that there is a PDF available in the $nh underscore home slash module slash alarm forwarder directory for your reference. Thank you for watching the video. For more information, please visit ca.com slash education.